How to watch Jujutsu Kaisen in order. Recently Jujutsu Kaisen has been taking the world by storm. And while we can say that the show carried the 2021 winter season when it came to anime, the delay in the movie release around the world surely must have some fellow weaves looking to get into the anime confused about where to start from. So I'm here to help you with that. Jujutsu Kaisen for those who haven't watched a single episode of the show, let me give you a brief introduction so that you can realize how good of a shonen show this is. So without any further ado, let's begin. For starters, Jujutsu Kaisen is a manga written by Giji Akutami. The manga started serialization all the way back in 2018. However, it wasn't until the end of 2021 that the manga got animated up until the death painting arc. The show follows the life of Itadori Yuji, who finds himself in a difficult place after the death of his grandfather. There he comes across Megume, a member of the secret Jujutsu society that exorcises curses. As the night proceeds, Itadori ends up eating a cursed finger that once belonged to Ryomen Sukuna, the king of curses. To Megume and his teacher's surprise, Itadori doesn't turn into Sukuna, but rather is able to tame him and still keep control of his body. Thus begins Itadori's hard and tragic life at Jujutsu High as he faces opposition from within and outside the Jujutsu Sorcerer Society. The manga has sold up to 70 million copies, making it one of the most successful mangas to ever exist. I think now you guys might have an idea of how good the show is and I'm not going to waste your time with any more details, as you all must be dying to watch the anime. Jujutsu Kaisen Zero So when it gets into the Jujutsu Kaisen franchise, it's best if you begin with the recently released movie, Jujutsu Kaisen Zero. Even though it may sound weird to watch the movie first, it came after the first season had aired and finished. It's actually a prequel to the first season. The movie stars an entirely new character as the protagonist, Yuta Okutsu. The events in Jujutsu Kaisen Zero take place exactly one year before Itadori's enrollment in Jujutsu High. And much like him, he's also under heavy fire as he's considered a threat to civilians for having an enormous amount of cursed energy and curse called Rika, the Queen of Curses. Despite the movie being a prequel, Gij actually created this before had created Jujutsu Kaisen and named the short manga as Tokyo Metropolitan Curse Technical School. But after the show gained popularity, it was renamed Jujutsu Kaisen Zero. The movie is now available on multiple streaming platforms, so it won't be a hassle for you to watch it. Plus, you wouldn't have to go through the agony that fans since the season had to go through and wait for the movie. Another reason that you should watch the prequel before starting the main story is that you will be able to understand many references that will be made in season one. Such as Tudu's terror when the seniors explained that he alone killed 50 demons in the night parade of 100 demons, or Megumi's remark about only respecting Yuta as his senior. Moreover, the movie also adds depth to characters that got little time in season one, such as Maki, Inumaki, and even Panda to some extent. Best of all, why this movie is worth watching is Gojo Sachiro. From stunning eye shots to the brilliant fight choreography and smooth animation that has been carried on since season one. The movie brilliantly explores more into Gojo's character more since not much of his backstory is revealed in the season. However, we get to see a side of Gojo that we never got to see before, and a mind-boggling truth is also revealed. Jujutsu Kaisen Season 1 Once you've watched the movie and are completely blown out of your mind after experiencing the brilliant yet horrific world of Jujutsu Kaisen, you'll immediately be craving for more. This is where Season 1 will come into play, and you'll be able to notice how things will shake up with Itadori's arrival at the school. Season 1 has around 24 episodes. 
so you will have plenty of content to watch, and it'll be just enough to quench your thirst for Season 2 of Jujutsu Kaisen, which will be coming to our screen in early 2023. However, do keep in mind that throughout Season 1, Yuta has no screen time, since the protagonist of our story is Itadori Yuji, but don't worry as you will immediately fall in love with him for his radiant personality and ability to stay optimistic, even in the darkest of times. And again, best of all, there will be a lot more Gojo. And let me tell you guys, no amount of Gojo is enough. That guy is just too fine to be ignored. Even though the world of Jujutsu Kaisen is really dark, one thing the season does better than the movie is always setting a mood according to the situation. From extremely intense moments, wholesome moments, relaxing moments, and hilarious moments to tragic deaths, this season is a blend of all. And while you may worry that this show might just be another Bleach, Naruto, or Black Clover, since the protagonist trying to control the demon inside. The first episode will make it really clear to you that Shukuna isn't a misunderstood character falsely accused and trapped as a curse, but rather an actually evil demon that once existed in the golden age of Jujutsu sorcery, and indulged in all sorts of evils before finally meeting his demise and being turned into a curse. Now that is all for today, my fellow weebs. I hope you now have a better understanding of how to get into this spectacular show and enjoy the dark yet humorous world. We'll be uploading more awesome videos just like this, so make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so that you don't miss out on any amazing anime-related content. Till then, sayonara.